Hi friends, welcome to Ova Studies YouTube channel. This is part 10 in Kusto playlist. In this video, we are going to discuss about project away, project keep operators in Kusto query language. In our past video, we discussed about project operator, right? So similar to project, there are something called project away, project keep operators that will also help us to take some columns or to avoid some columns in the output on top of any table. When I practically explain this with an example, you will make more sense of it. Before watching this Kusto playlist, I want to remind you that please consider watching Azure Data Explorer playlist at least 4 or 5 videos and then previous videos of Kusto playlist as well so that you will get most out of this video. So let's explain or let's go ahead and see how this project away operator will actually help you. So as I said here, it will select what columns from the input table to exclude from the output table. So let's assume you have an input table here called T from that uh, if you want to exclude few columns and get all other columns then you can use project away. So let's assume in a table you have 100 columns and you want to only exclude two columns all other 98 columns you want to get so in that case if you use project as i explained in my last video it is going to take every column like for example you have to write all the 98 columns with commas separated like this right if you haven't seen my project operator video please watch that but with project away you can only mention that two excluded columns so that you can get all remaining 98 columns let me practically show you this Let's go to Kusto Explorer. I have already opened here and there is a help cluster in which I have samples database. In the samples database, I have something called Strom events table. So we are discussing or we are referring same table in most of the examples. Okay. So this table will contain Strom's related information, right? So let me go ahead here, add a new tab and here we can write our query, right? So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to write from events table so i am not using any operator right now let me hit this run button to execute this query and let me practically show you this data so this is strom events table will contain for each state level what kind of strom happened when it happened and all that kind of information also it will have like how many injured so for example in north california for thunderstorm wind Injuries directly zero, injuries indirectly also zero. So and de deaths direct zero, uh, deaths indirectly also zero. So we have that this kind of data, and we have so many columns here. Now I want to uh, take uh, only I or I want to take all the columns, but I don't want to take this uh, uh, only. I don't want to take this project injuries direct and injuries indirect columns. So in that case, what I can do, I can use this project away because I want to avoid these columns. What columns I want to avoid? Injuries direct and also we want to avoid injuries indirect columns. So now let me hit this run button and let's wait for the output to come here. In the output, if we observe, we will be not seeing these two columns. Why? Because we excluded them by using project away operator. So you can see the output came here and when I scroll, you see you don't see that indirect sorry injuries direct injuries indirect columns here you you can clearly see you can clearly see the entire output so nowhere it which it will be not there actually so this is why we can avoid okay and not only this whether we have to maintain like we have to write every column name which we want to exclude no we can use pattern as well if you closely observe these two columns injuries is common in the both the column names right so i can use a pattern also here so what i can do injuries then star that means any column which will have injuries which starts with injuries and star means after that it can have anything else so if if there is any column like that then uh, get or take out those columns so what i will do this time instead of injuries for you to make sense deaths direct deaths indirect column is there so what i am going to use here is deaths direct and death direct these two columns i am going to avoid and I am going to avoid using the uh, expression or pattern like this. So now let me hit this run button to execute this query and let's wait for query to run here. Now if you examine the result, you see now you got injuries direct and injuries indirect columns, but deaths direct, deaths indirect columns not came. 
the reason is we use the pattern to avoid them so we can use either pattern or use full column name so let's go back to presentation there is something called project keep as well so what this will do it will select what columns from the input to keep in the output that means what and all the columns it is opposite to project away so it will exclude the columns it will include the columns whatever you give so then you will be thinking like what is the difference between project and project keep both will be doing the same it is including the columns the the main key advantage is in the project keep we can use a pattern also for example from this entire uh, let's take the same example from the strong events table i want to get only injuries direct and injuries indirect columns okay so i can write project operator like this and if i run this it will definitely get me only those two columns you it is getting now if you if i use project if i try to use a pattern here instead of writing every column name will that work it won't work so let me hit this run button it will definitely not work it will end up with a error but instead of project if i use project keep then i can use the pattern as well instead of typing every column name and now this time if i execute this query it will get the both the columns so not only pattern we can directly use full column names as well i was just to explain you there is a difference between project and project keep that pattern is not supported in the project i just took that as an example so now if i run this still it will work okay so like this project keep and project away operators will help you to include the columns or to exclude the columns accordingly so i hope you got this video very helpful thank you for watching this video please subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon to get the notifications whenever i add videos thank you so much